hey, I just got off a meeting and I wanted to pop in and tell you what I heard. So a lot of times, especially right now when interest rates are really high, I see people saying, should I pay extra money to my mortgage? How much can I pay down my mortgage? Because they're really just trying to save money on that interest and it's freaking them out that their payment might go up when their mortgage renews. Now, I know that that is a concern and it's one way to do it, but I always say, keep and control your money. Now, I think mathematically, generally, when you do the math on if you invest the difference versus paying down your mortgage, you still typically come out ahead. But there's one other reason why I recommend that is because when you own and control your money, if life throws you a curveball, you cannot eat the equity in your home. In fact, you have to get a loan to spend your equity, don't you? So it's not really your money, is it? Now, I just met with a lady and that's the situation she's in. Her company transferred her to a different city and for two years, she's been unable to sell her home. So she's paying rent and a mortgage and she's pulling money from investments every single month to make that happen. If she had instead invested the extra payments that she was making, she would have control over that money and be in a totally different situation.